reach over to the left, or the, we're reaching over to the right, extending out through the top arm. And feel a nice stretch. Well, I just tried my hand at a little bit of yoga, thanks to Erin here at the Body Mind Centre here in Thunder Bay. Now, the reason why I'm down here at the Body Mind Centre is uh, to tell you guys about Can one of Canada's largest fundraisers for arthritis, and it's a yoga fundraiser. I'm here with Erin, who's the owner of the Body Mind Centre. Now, Erin, tell me about Power of Movement. What is Power of Movement? Power of Movement is where yoga studios all across Canada are getting together to help people realize that movement is the best solution for people suffering from arthritis. Arthritis. So no matter what someone's age is, they can be affected. So we have staff here who from a very early age um, had trouble moving and even spent some of their childhood in a wheelchair. And we also have seniors who come every week and you wouldn't even know their ages in their 70s and 80s because they're bebopping on exercise balls and flex bands and things. So this Power of Movement on March the 4th is all about getting people from the community to come in and move doing gentle yoga, both hot and not hot, to show their support for arthritis in Canada. So um, when we walked in here actually I noticed there was quite a range of people coming in and out of the building from young to old and I know that's one of the stigmas is that a lot of people think that uh, arthritis is an o older person's uh, disease. Right and actually our seniors class they're called 55 plus but there's no one under 70 in the class. They move and they groove and most of them do have arthritis but you never know so they keep their joints really healthy by moving regularly so not only do they attend classes twice a week here and some do more than that but they walk to the class so they're walking from home to come here even in the winter time that's great. Now I just uh, had my first taste of it. That was my first time ever doing yoga in a classroom and it was great. I feel, and, we, and I didn't stay for the whole class, but I, I feel really good. Well, thank you for that. You're welcome. <laughs> so how does it work? So on, on the date, then March 4th, so well, actually, people need network? to get started right away. Okay. So they can go to powerofmovement.ca and get a registration form. And then you start talking to your friends and people at Bridge Club and wherever you're going <laughs> and get them to sponsor and let them know how it's such a great cause. And then on the day of, we're going to have the two classes, one from 1 until 2 in the not hot room and then from 2 until 3 in the hot room. And those pledges that you've gathered can either be sent through online through PayPal or they can be dropped off at the Body Mind Center and we'll seal them up and send them to the Arthritis Society. So 100% of the funds are going to arthritis research and the Body Mind Center is donating the space and the teachers are donating their time for this great event. That's excellent. Now, how did you get involved with it? How did you find out about this? Event? Well, I heard about it last year, actually, from some massage therapists who were like, Erin, how come the Body Mind Center isn't involved? <laughs> so I didn't know about it prior to last year. And so Emily contacted us this year, and she asked us to get on board, and we're super thrilled to be a part of this fundraising event. Now, tell our viewers quick uh, that don't know about yoga, what does yoga do? Well, yoga is actually an incredible science of the body. So here in the West, a lot of people do it for exercise, which is a good thing, but there's a, there's a big background, actually 10,000 years worth of knowledge about yoga. It affects the central nervous system and the autonomic nervous system. So what that means in short is that it's a really great way to help calm people, to reduce tension and stress, to actually bring balance to the body and the internal organs and especially the endocrine system so people can have optimum health. And here here at the Body Mind Center, we actually have 18 different levels of yoga. Wow. So we can start with people who can barely move. That's my class. It's yeah. called Yoga for the Inflexible. <laughs> okay. And that's on Monday. So anybody can come give it a try. And then we move up through the levels and stages up to things that we say kick people's butts. So if you like a super big workout, we have it. But if you can barely move, we can help you as well. Great, that would be one for me. <laughs> so Power of Movement, all the funds go to the Arthritis Society of Canada? Yes. Great. For their research. For their research. Yes. Perfect. Excellent. So I, I encourage you all to, uh, to play a part in, in the power of movement and help uh, a great cause. Oh, there's one other thing. Oh, so for people living in communities where they can't get into the Body Mind oh, Center, if they're in Red Rock, Marathon, or anywhere else, mm -hmm. you can do a virtual class online. Wow. Cool. How so check that? powerofmovement.ca for all the details and they'll hook you up through Skype or um, through your computer and then you can do it along with everybody else. Isn't technology amazing? Yeah, it is amazing. <laughs> it pulls Great. everybody together. It sure does. Yeah. Thanks so much, Erin. I appreciate Thanks, you letting Sarah. me be here and uh, do a little bit of yoga. Great. So support Power of Movement.